Good day everyone! I am Teacher Sheila and you are at your English Hub! us to find out if a particular information is reliable or not, we need to consider these six characteristics of an information. Okay, so let us have the three characteristics of an information. Uh, it's not three, it's six characteristics of an information. Let us have the first one, accuracy. Okay, from the root word, accurate. We can say that a particular information is accurate or possessing this accuracy if the information is reliable useful, free from flaws, and of high quality. Okay? So that is the first characteristic that a particular information should have in order for us to find out that it is reliable or not. Okay? Or if we can use them or apply them in our daily lives. Okay? So remember that there are always fake information or fake news okay so we need to be very careful when it comes to this one so that is why we are talking or discussing this characteristics of information which is we have the first one accuracy the information should be reliable useful free from flaws and of high quality let us have the second characteristic which is completeness okay it should provide all the information needed it should answer the wh questions is it clear so when we say good information or true information it should always be complete and it should always provide all the needed information and it should answer the WH questions. What are these WH questions? We have who, what, when, where, why, and how. Okay, so if the information can answer all those six WH questions, meaning that information has this completeness. Let us have timeliness. Okay, usually, for, uh, most importantly, when it comes to news, the information should always be timely. Okay, it should be up to date. Let us have the last three classifications of our three characteristics of information. The fourth one is consistency. Okay, from the word, from the root word, consistent. It should be consistent for it to be considered accurate and useful. Okay, consistent. Meaning, it is not what? Ha? Hindi siya pa bago bago. Okay? Next, relevant. It should suit the demand, needs, and interests of the readers. Okay, relevant. Relevant. And the last one is uniqueness. It should be distinct. Distinct means unique. Okay, so those are the six characteristics that we need to consider in dealing or in um, dealing with this with the inform with this different information in order to for us to find out if that particular information is good or not or reliable or not again we have accuracy we have 
The second one, completeness, timeliness, consistency, relevant, and uniqueness. Okay, so that's all for today. I hope that you have learned something from this discussion. And see you again in our next session. Thank you and bye-bye!